This guy, this fight's not even about this guy. It's about making this guy. It's about making this, right? And I'm like, okay, well, you guys aren't gonna let me go because I'm the best fighter here, and you're not gonna let me go unless it's off of somebody. I gotta make somebody for you. Well, all right, you, well, you're welcome. Let's make you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome, UFC. You're welcome. You're welcome, Dubai. You're welcome, all you in your country. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You're welcome. And uh, this is just my halftime show. I'm just getting started, so that's where I'm with that. And what I'm saying is, I'm going to, I'm going to knock. I, I'm going to finish. I'm a gangster. Like pfft. we ain't even talking about all that. It's like you want. Why are you even talking to me? Why are you even talking about me? Why is UFC been disrespecting and making me be like their fall guy or something? F him, f them, f everybody. And uh, this is just a, this is just a start for me. This whole fight is not brought to you by the UFC. This fight is brought to you by Real Fight Incorporated. Straight the f up mm -hmm. because it's not the UFC putting on Nate Diaz versus f whatever his f name is. It's it's you and this versus me get the loss. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you something. Let's say I do lose and get my ass whipped by this who you guys are saying is the best thing to have ever happened coming coming up, right? And he might be, but you got a little overshooting, and then you're just shooting them out, and you're shooting them out on me because I'm going to get it out the loudest. So they're using me to get it out there. Yeah. So, um... If that's how it's gonna be, let's just say I get my ass stomped out, right? Let's just say that happens for for a second. And everybody's saying that. Everybody's saying that too. And everybody who is saying that, especially the fighters and the media and the fighters who are saying, oh, you know, you know what I'm saying? For one, you know, all together and uh Where's your facts? You fought Burns, dog. You fought Burns. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. If I get my ass whipped, guess what? Still got a free free agent out there who's now mm -hmm. only, who might have just got his ass whipped, but he's still only the number two fighter in the world because he just the champion of the welterweight division, and he's losing to the guy who are you claiming is the next biggest, best thing in the in the thing. So <clears throat> get it done, and you better get it done because pressure's on you. I don't give a. F I feel like like you your um your like. Why are you even talking my name though? That's what I'm saying. I'm like I wasn't even trying to fight BJ Penn. And they're like, oh, I'm a young gangster. Like, why are you dumb? Why are you talking to me like that? Mm -hmm. One reason why you fight is because of me. And most of the people. And I ain't demanding respect. This fight game, I don't need no respect. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's forever. So when he says he's a fan of yours, I he grew up he watching you. Or, or not fully or whatever, but you're a fan of whatever. It's not even about that. He said what he had to say because he felt like he needed to say that. Because he felt like... Cause he knew